Well, it's been one of our top stories of the day. The Florida Gators getting rid of Dan Mullen as their head coach. Oh, it's a big deal. Much of the community is buzzing about what's next. Joining us now is the host of Gators Breakdown podcast, Dave Waters. So first of all, Dave, welcome. And how did we get here? More about wins and losses. It really is deeper than that. Uh, of course, not good for Florida this year, but sure. there, there's some symptoms, as Scott Strickland, the AD, said. Recruiting was never at the level it should have been for Florida. Like that, you got to compete with Georgia. You got to compete with Alabama. You got to get those players. Dan Mullen wasn't doing that on a consistent basis. And then the things that you could count on game management, uh, games to play. How do the Gators handle this going forward? Senior day, Saturday. So these seniors are playing their last game. You hope you know, it's, a, it's a rivalry game. You got to go beat Florida State. That's what they're uh, going to go be go, going to go do now. So now there's no distraction of all the talk around. Dan Mullen being the head coach. Now you just go out there and play one last game to see if you can get that victory in your last game of the season. So now they're also going to be focused on who will replace Dan Mullen. So some of the names that are floating out there right now. Some of the names. Lane Kiffin, Ole Miss. Oh, uh, yeah. A name to watch oh. out for there. Uh, that, that would cause a stir in the SEC. Uh, Bob Stoops, former defensive coordinator for Florida, former head coach of Oklahoma's names up there. Uh, one kind of under the radar a little bit, not in Gator Nation, but around the country, Billy Napier at Louisiana. Hmm. Was coached under Nick Saban at Alabama, has been the head coach of Louisiana for a few years now, Gets, has raised, risen that program up to levels they've never seen before. Under the radar name. So, real fall. quickly, Greg Knox is temporarily taking over? Great. Special how, do they, how do they go under him? Well, can Knox do this? Hey. Uh, it's good to know, at least going into Florida State game, we're obviously not going to take sides, but we will see <laughs> how it goes. It'll be a very dicey situation in <laughs> Gatorland down in Gainesville. And one more thing, here's a reminder. Check out our Gators breakdown under the sports tab on newsforjacks.com. Thanks, Dave.